Well, if mortgage interest rates also inch higher, the dream of home ownership will move further out of reach for many families. And tonight's Housing Watch, Action News anchor Delia Wrong joins us with the Valley County, which landed on a list of the nation's most unaffordable counties. Dale? Lauren and Margo, not a list you want to be on. Counties which include cities where many people relocated during the pandemic, Boise, Idaho, Naples, Florida, and Austin, Texas were the top three. Unfortunately, Merced County also ranked high on that list. The price of homes all around the valley has soared in the past few years, but Merced County was ranked as the 15th most unaffordable county in the U.S. by the personal finance tech company MoneyGeek. So what we did in our analysis is we looked through and we found uh, the counties in America that had a, a high ratio of you know, mortgage and housing expenses compared to their incomes. Doug Milne says their data locked in on areas of high population growth and high price appreciation. He noticed housing prices rose in Merced County by 45% in the past three years. I looked at last month's sales data in Merced County and it uh, indicated that the median home sale price um, in March was $415,000. Milne says you need a household income of $95,000 to afford that home. The individual median income in Merced County is just under $31,000. The rising number of Bay Area commuters moving to Los Banos continues to drive up home prices countywide. City planner Stacy Souza Elms knows residents face a very difficult challenge. Maybe you're a hairdresser or you're a single mom, you're probably going to be in that lower income bracket. And where are you going to live? You're going to get pushed out. So we need that affordable housing inventory to be able to keep our locals here in Los Banos. And we're already seeing many people who grew up here moving to even smaller valley towns in search of homes within their budget. Fresno County was way down in the 136 spot. Milne says home prices have gone up 36% in the past three years, but the population growth in Fresno County has not been as explosive as other U.S. counties. Dale Yurong, ABC 30 Action News. Thank you for watching. For more videos like this from ABC 30, just make sure to hit that subscribe button below.